Welcome! We're going to start a new painting today. This piece is called My Heart Swells, and here's the sketch for it. It's a little piece, so um, it's a 9 by 12, and I decided versus making a large painting, I wanted this to be a little piece. A little intimate painting of the mother with the child and um, the expectant belly. We're zoomed up quite closely on the canvas. So we're going to give this a shot and see how it goes. And this is how we're going to start the painting, My Heart Swells. Little, uh, the painting kind of wants to be horizontal, uh, kind of wants to be vertical now that I think about it, now that I have everything set up for a horizontal painting. So if you'll give me a second, I'm going to reset everything up so that this can be a uh, vertical painting. Okay, so I have my paints ready. I've got the canvas now set up as a vertical. And I got my paints, I got my brushes, and like I said, this is kind of weird. I've not done the um, paintings where you just see my hand, but why well, actually I have done the ones where you just see my hand, but this one still feels different. Whoops! Still feels different uh, for some reason today. I think it's just because the camera is so close to the canvas and it's almost like a little, little, uh, little peeping Tom there peeking at the canvas. So we're gonna have some fun though. My name is Katie Bergeron, in case you don't know, and my website is km. Bergren.com and we are working on My Heart Swells and it's a little sketch right here and this is uh, just going to be a fun little intimate piece. I thought about making it larger but um, decided in the end that I kind of wanted it to be small and a little peek into a room of a, of a mother cuddling her child and uh, I mainly like to capture the you know, the intimacy and the uh, those quiet moments. So uh, I don't know why I'm doing eyelashes. They're just going to get painted over. That happens a lot though. I'm not quite sure why <laughs> I just did that, but um, frequently I paint over large chunks of painting because I, I get going on it and, and I do things that kind of t more to plan how I'm gonna come back and do it later because in the end, it will come back. <laughs> I was playing with this painting on the idea of swells as, you know, how our, how we feel so filled up and, and our heart truly swells when, you know, something, something happens maybe with our child or, or even, you know, with a, with a stranger, uh, just, you know, a quick moment that sort of makes us feel all warm and and wonderful inside and um, and in her her belly which is of course expectant so it's swollen too I wanted to to do a play off of off play on words for this piece it's fairly low tech here in the studio as you can see I just have my uh, canvas stacked up on bottles of paint because <laughs> that, that allows me to adjust the height of whatever I'm working on and uh, large paintings have a nice little place to sit but um, the small ones I kind of have to get creative which is fine. I like things low tech and I like things simple. All of the paintings start out as brown and white on canvas. Always, always brown on white. No color for a while. Color can be beautiful and wonderful and mess the whole thing up pretty darn quickly. And this is beginning to feel like a uh, painting lesson, but it's not going to be a painting lesson. I, um, I haven't submitted to uh, being a painting instructor just yet, although I've had many people ask at this point, I'm going to just get us started, and then pretty quick here, I will uh, speed up the tape so you can sit back and just watch the magic happen in a speeded up fashion. Mm. This is my favorite paint, golden. Uh, I never am quite sure how long the painting's going to take, but.
but uh, I don't really care. I don't really keep track all that much. I just sort of paint for the paint. And I paint for the sake of painting because I love it. <laughs>